Hey guys, it's Brandon 302 and today guys we are back with another video. So in today's video, I am going to be showing you how to make an item spawner. So um I'm gonna be using this item right here as an example. Uh this laser gun thing. I'm gonna be using this as, as an example and it is gonna be spawning on uh this pad thing right here. So um, you guys can put whatever you want under it. I'm just actually having this so people can see that it's actually spawning on something. Um, so yeah, I'm just going to put this like that. There we go. Um, then what you guys will have to do is you guys will have to group these together. You guys will have to group the tool and uh, the bottom piece together. So let's group them. And let's just name this. Let's just name this weapon let's do laser whoops laser spawner there we go we got a laser spawner with our laser gun and also the circle now I'm gonna be naming uh, this instead of just circle I'm gonna be naming it the weapon spawner all right so uh, you guys will have to name this the weapon spawner uh, you can keep the tool name as whatever you want and any scripts inside of it are fine um, but yeah then what we will be doing is we will be putting a script into the weapon spawner um and then you guys will have to go into the description and copy the script uh but luckily i got the script of me but you guys will have to copy the script into the description it should say link to script um yeah this is the whole script right here unless if you want to type it out uh it's on the screen right now this line's pretty long so yeah um but yeah here's a script right here um so how do you customize this how do you customize this well before we can actually get the script to start working because if we go in the game just with the script it will not work so we actually got to add something into the weapon spawner here and we will have to add something called a configuration now i'm going to name it uh configurations and then in the configurations we will have to add something called an int value and then uh we will name this spawn cooldown we will name that spawn cooldown next what you will have to do is in the script um here's a script right here um i'm gonna tell you a little bit like about of what some of this stuff means um so this for example right here is a spawn cooldown so this is how much time you want to give before the item respawns now uh for this video i'm just going to do two seconds and then uh you guys will also have to update the spawn cooldown in the configurations as well so let's set that as two um yeah everything else you really don't have to change except for the spawn cooldown so yeah, if we go into game, let's go over here. As you can see, it is spinning uh, and yeah, we got the item here. So then we pick it up. As you can see, I have it and then it respawns after two seconds. One, two, there we go. So yeah, um, that is technically how you make an item spawner you can make it with any item you want you just have to put this in here have a weapon have a weapon spawner put the script in the weapon spawner like the so you guys will yeah you guys will have to have uh something on the bottom for it for it to actually spawn on i could actually just um if i didn't want it to actually spawn on something like say i'm making a game where you can just find random stuff around the map I would probably do transparency one and then maybe set the can collide off um so then when i go into game as you can see there's a random item there and then uh yeah and then as you can see i can just grab it real quick and be on my way um and then yeah maybe you could turn the spawn spawn uh cooldown up a little bit to make it spawn less but yeah um 
The script is going to be set to 10 seconds. I'm just going to be setting it to 10 seconds, but you guys can change it right there whenever you want. So that's really all you have to customize with this. You don't really have to customize anything else, but yeah, that's how you change it. And yeah, it's 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 pretty simple to make. I'm not even gonna lie. Um, but yeah, um, if you actually wanted to detail it more, uh, like make it stand out more, I would recommend adding a point light, a point light into here, as you can see. And then, you know, maybe like changing the color a little bit to make it just more realistic. Let's put the brightness up a little bit. There, like that. And let's just make it. Let's just make it blue because the gun is blue. So there we go. Now, now it stands out more. Now it stands out more. So as you can see, if I go over here, it stands out a lot more. So it's your guys' choice what you want to do with that. But yeah, that's all you really need to make an item spawner in Roblox. So thank you guys so much for watching this video. Um, I hope this video helps. Make sure to subscribe, smash the like button, and check some of my other scripting videos in the top right. There's a playlist of my other scripting videos. Maybe it could help you, um, uh, like, if you're making a game or anything. But, yes, um, that's how you make an item spawner in Roblox. Very simple, very easy to do. And, yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. I will see you guys all in the next one. And, bye!